Uh, well, the the wind could be beneficial for one thing today. If they have a wind at their back, the soapbox derby that Allison's at this morning, that will be running fast. Hey guys. Hi, Allison. Hey, I survived. You did. You did. That's right. Tell us what it was like. It was not nearly as scary as I thought it was going to be. I'll tell you that. <laughs> and I kept it pretty straight, and I used the brake a lot earlier than they said I needed to because I was a little antsy. <laughs> I thought but, I saw that. Yeah, I did okay. And I guess they, they trade buttons here. So this is uh, the button they gave me. That's what my face looked like <laughs> as I was going down. Oh, I wish we could have seen it. That's funny. <laughs> yeah. So that's Mark on here. Mark's right here, ready to go. You can't see his face. He probably doesn't look like that either. Uh, hey, Mark. What what do you think the wind is going to do here? Uh, probably pushes a little bit faster than normal. There you go. And Mark is racing against Kirsten, who's been racing about four years. Mark's been going for six. So who's going to win? Um, I'm not really sure. Hopefully me. <laughs> there you go. That's the attitude to have. <laughs> so we're going to let them go here. I like how they have uh, ads on the cars too, like NASCAR, because the the cars are about. Mm, 500 bucks, I guess, to, to make the kit okay, not cheap. and go. So they got to help pay for them. There they go. And that's and they, interesting they that like they run to, to the outside. Yeah, yeah, because the road kind of, um, you know, curves a little bit or crowns up in the middle. So they like to go to that side. Sue is the president of the Green Bay Area Derby. Uh, can we tell who's winning? Um, they should announce it to us as soon as they get down there. Um, okay. Right now, if I had to guess, I'd say Mark is, but it looks like it's a pretty close race. Because they have timers down there, right? Yep, we have infrared timers, so we can tell how, who wins and by how much. We've had races where they, one car will win by point zero zero one. Wow. And we've had dead heats where they've gone down at the exact same time crossing the finish line. So, yeah, it's it is a very exact science, and they come up and go back down again. During a race, what they'd do is we'll load them on the trailers, bring them up, they'd swap all four wheels, and then they'd swap what lane they go in. They'd go down a second time against each other, and the differentials get added together or subtracted, and whoever wins by the most is the winner. The other one goes on through our consolation bracket. Oh, very interesting. It's all very detailed, guys. Um, so thank you so much for having us thank today. You. Have fun today. And again, guys, we're on Centennial Street, which is, if you're familiar with Ashwaubenon, it's right by Highway 41 on Wabi Lane. We're right behind Steins here. They've closed off sure. the street. So they'll be doing this all day today and tomorrow. Just a real fun activity where the kids learn a lot, work with their parents. So if you're interested, you can come by and check it out. They're giving free rides, one free ride to kids who just want to come by and check it out. All Sounds right. Sounds like a fun sport cool. to get involved in. Thanks, Allison. Thanks, Allison. Mm -hmm. Sure.